A local family is grief stricken tonight after a toddler falls into a landscape pond. The 18 month old boy was pulled from the pond on Casey Court in Fairfield last night. Family members started CPR, but he was pronounced dead at the hospital. Local 12 News reporter Sydney Benter live in Fairfield with the latest on the investigation. Sydney. Good afternoon. It has been a somber day in this Fairfield neighborhood. Everyone agrees that what happened to little An Luong was a terrible accident, one that many people can't imagine having to cope with. Sydney, is he still in the water? No, no, he's out of it. He's just, he's on the couch right now. My dad's trying to give him CPR. An 18 month old died after falling into this pond in the backyard of a home on Casey Court. The accident is shaking up neighbors. One mom we talked to as a child the very same age. That's what makes me sad. My heart just really goes out to the family. I mean, I can't imagine, you know, because it's, you can't, I don't know. This breaks my heart. <laughs> Emergency responders are also reeling from the accident. The Fairfield Fire Chief says he's going to recommend post-traumatic counseling for a couple of the medics who responded to the scene. And he has a recommendation for everyone else, too. Oftentimes we relate the depth of the water to the potential for drowning. And that's not the case in any, any situation. And this tragedy brings that to the forefront. Emergency responders have a close tie to the family who just lost their youngest son. The family owns an alteration business and is responsible for keeping the department's uniforms looking their best. Because the majority of our people in the fire department uh, know members of the family and, um, you know, our hearts and souls reach out to them and certainly we'll keep them in our prayers. Now, Chief Bennett says that a lot of the neighbors got together last night in a cul-de-sac down the street and had a prayer circle for the little boy. We did go to the uh, to the strip mall where the family's business is. Everyone only had kind things to say about the family. We're told they're wonderful parents. Live in Fairfield, Sydney Benter, Local 12 News. Heavy hearts all around. Sydney, thank you.